This case shows a 70-year-old male patient with an endothelial cell count of 1,400 cells per square millimeter. He underwent uncomplicated cataract surgery with a Malugan ring in his right eye two weeks prior. His surgery in his left eye began with placement of a Malugan ring just as it had in his first eye. After the ring is placed, a zonular abnormality was noted inferiorly and the recording begins. With manipulation of the ring, a flat segment of the lens equator flanked by two small bulges, the Mickey Mouse sign, was noted indicative of congenital zonular defects and colobomas. These types of defects usually have healthy intact zonules except in the affected area. In this case, the affected area was relatively small. The chamber and the area over the zonular defect were filled with a cohesive viscoelastic. In cases with zonular abnormalities, care should be taken to try to center the rexus on the anterior capsule rather than on the pupil. In this case, the rexus was completed without difficulty and laxity was only noted with force directed superiorly. I decided to bowl out the nucleus in the bag, being careful to direct any gentle force opposite the so-called ears of the lens to avoid displacing the capsule. Once most of the lens material has been sculpted away, the epinuclear shell is prolapsed out of the bag and aspirated away without ultrasound. The remaining cortex is stripped away, again being careful not to direct any force superiorly, perpendicular to the area of missing zonules. A capsular tension ring is placed followed by a three-piece IOL. The Malugan ring is removed and viscoelastic aspirated from the eye. Finally, the case is completed with intracameral antibiotic. I hope you find this video useful and thanks for watching.